Oh, it's far too big. Yeah, this my this is the animation I made, just for the fun of it. Why not? Oops, that was a silly thing to do. There we go. This is my animation. Thousands of lines of code. Yeah, that's um yeah, remember those katana? Yeah, I uh yeah, did similar things. And how many times did you you press your tape recorder to record the program, and find out you've overwritten the last save you did, and the save you did now is just not working properly. So, yeah, that's my little animation. It's not uh, brilliant, but uh, I'm happy with it. And it goes and starts again. Go away. There we go. Back to the game. Yeah, so it's uh, it's a long cur it's a long learning curve altogether from when you <laughs> you first get um, you get into computers. I suppose it, it's, it's so it was easy, wasn't it? Um, Katana, I've no idea how old you are, and I wouldn't even dare to ask. But um, I assume that uh, because you had a TRS-80 as a first computer, you must be over 21 now. Um, but them days you could actually get down to the the root level of computers and it was such a such a big thing to be able to do. I used to go to mates and say oh I did this on my computer last night. You haven't got a computer have you? Oh wow come and come and see your computer. And this is the way it was. Um, long gone. Everybody's got computers. Uh, everybody walks around with a computer in their pocket nowadays. So yeah and somewhere along the line I fell behind so there we go right how's the uh, picture holding up yeah Good. oh that's okay Smashing. yeah we're gonna have to address the lighting problem if anybody's got any suggestions on lighting I'm sorry yeah Party bug seventy. Um, welcome aboard. Um, yeah, nice to be followed. Um, but yeah, I was just in conversation with Katana five one four there, um, uh, and we're reminiscing about the days of um, Sinclair Spectrums, TRS eighties, uh, and the like. And uh, it's um, yeah, the times have changed, haven't they? <laughs> he says. <laughs> of course they've changed. Or oh, BBS boards. I, n I never did BBS. I Somebody told me. Um, now I can't remember. Gosh. It's, it's funny how that little spark lights up in the brain. And you don't know what to... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Should we call this the old Codgers channel now? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. I I tried doing BBS because I, I was a radio amateur in the in the, in the uh, I don't know what date it would be in the seventies I suppose um, early seventies maybe mid seventies and I was there's so many things going through your life at these times where you uh, it's time demanding and what have you and so uh, you you tend to forget but for some reason BBS somebody told me don't go on there because of this that and the next thing. And I, of course, listened to them. I didn't have a mind of my own, I don't think. Have we got something broken here? It's chatting too much and not paying attention to the freezer, which is dying. Now, why... That's strange, isn't it, eh? Josie just popped out a minute ago and collected some strawberries. I wonder why she did that, unless she's having a strawberry punch or something, I don't know. Be friendly with Kibby. 
Well, you can be friendly if you like. Yeah, Kibby. Become best friends. There you go. Sorted. Uh, I'm 45, but my sins is going adult. Young adult, yes. Well done, Kibby. She's just gone up a level in uh, household repairs. Right, let's get rid of these snapdragons. That puts money in the till. At least 90 simoleons. Uh, potatoes there, they can go as well. Another 10 simoleons. Mushrooms, that's got to be good for 10 simoleons as well. Oh, 16. That's my eyesight, that is. Gosh. Yeah, so that's uh, basically my history on uh, on computers. Um, they're good fun even now, though. I, I still uh, I still like to um, play around with computers, strip them down and put them back together again, and be funny with Josie. Okay. Mm. Tell a funny story. I want to say a story. Right, I suppose we ought to get think about the gardening again because now we've really got to get stuck in and evolve these plants. You have to do them one at a time. If you can. And the reason why we're doing that's a normal strawberry bush. That one is now a nice strawberry bush. And so we can continue and so it gets better and better to be an excellent strawberry bush eventually, we hope. Mustn't take anything for granted. It's a Carmen relaxing stream and that's what I go for. Oh well, there we go. Calm and relaxed. You mean I'm not allowed to be a nervous wreck and get all agitated? <laughs> okay. I can live with that. I don't know um, if I'm doing this right and whether it's um, I'm making any mistakes or if the stuff I should be doing I'm not doing or stuff that I am doing that I shouldn't be doing um, and I can only rely on you the listeners and watchers to uh, advise me on that. Um, I have watched uh, other people broadcast as I say I've uh, watched Kiss for Luck and uh, Quill 18 and Arumba and these sort of people. Um, who seem to be seasoned veterans at uh, at doing the live streaming and what have you. Um, this is my first ever live stream, um, and got lots to do, lots lots to learn. I'm, I dare say, uh, we've managed to get over the um, the problems with the audio and a little bit, a few problems with lighting in the background, um, which seem to make my chroma keys all get bogged down with something I don't know what now what are you two doing come on you can't be out there just that's a nice strawberry bush right come and harvest them right what I'm going to do is move these apple trees a bit further apart I think They're all perched on top of one another, they don't get a chance to grow. Yeah, just opening these up a bit so as uh, you can see them better and uh, I suppose a good gardener would have them sorted so that, uh, there we go, they're not cramped on top of one another or anything like that. Okay, back to the live mode again. 
see this is what I found when I was doing my little practice run is you get the occasional plant like that there which really really looks the runt of the litter doesn't it it's normal stra these all strawberry bushes aren't they right, what's she up to I right, certainly need water in that one check the stream It's, uh, the nice thing about having three sisters um, all together is that they keep each other social and they keep each other having fun. Well, I'm not complaining, but so far we don't seem to have had many bills coming. But why do I get the feeling that's going to change any time at all? Um, how does a bill system work? I know they drop something in your box and you're supposed to pay a bill, but is that based on electricity usage or water usage or... Uh, I don't know. What? <laughs> Toilet usage? If it's water usage, then we bill's going to get exceedingly high. Repair. Yeah, thoroughly enjoying this game. I haven't got any add-ons yet. Uh, somebody asked me if it was just the uh, if I had any add-ons within the game, and I haven't. This is just the way it comes out of the box. Um, and as I said at the time when somebody asked me, it is my birthday soon, and hopefully, maybe, somebody might buy me an add-on pack. To all those family members listening, hint, hint. But get together so I don't get two of the same one. You understand. Um, there's a night being forward, is there, eh? So. Right, get the plants watered. Um, oh, come on. Nothing like admitting defeat that you can't fix the toilet, isn't it? Well, I've got a big gap here. Oh, that was for the uh, dishwasher, wasn't it? But we couldn't afford a dishwasher. We couldn't find the dishwashers originally because, um, just for anybody who's joined and didn't know, I didn't know where half the stuff was. I don't know. Um, I don't know whether I'm doing right or wrong. There we go. Put that in there for now. Um, oh, look at this. Get somebody clean. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Water spraying everywhere. somebody to upgrade the um, yeah evolve get these mushroom plants evolved then it's going to be uh, is that seven is that s the total amount of jobs you can allocate to people Right, thanks for that, uh, Eagle-eyed Lintio. That's um, that's interesting to know. So the lower level stuff that you've got, um, the cheaper it'll be on them. Yeah, I suppose. Call it council tax. <laughs> yeah. Are you are you from England or Britain or are you from a different country? I don't know. I didn't tell you that. That'd be interesting to know. 
not that it's any of my business really but uh, it'd be nice to know where in the world these people are gardening four come on it's doing good their reading box. Six, seven. <coughs> the idea of evolving the plants in the garden is because they come better quality. Um, I dare say most of you would know that anyway. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Katana five one four. I'm in the US. That's good. Um, don't hold it against me. I didn't pick Donald Trump. Nope. Apparently we wouldn't let him into the country for some reason. I don't know the guy personally, but. Um, Yeah, I don't want to get political. <laughs> don't suppose Donald Trump wants to either, but never mind. Um, so America, big place, never been there. Don't suppose I'll ever get there either, thinking about it, because I'm scared of flying. Don't want to go into a plane because I'm not exactly the safest method of travel anymore, not with some person plant, say, yeah. Uh, the clock with dynamite inside the things they don't become very safe then so anyway as I say not going to get political it's uh, too much that goes on in the world right then girls come on let's get this done properly let's evolve these plants The sooner they're evolved, the better money you get. I think I did that one twice. Never mind. And Carol, you can do some as well. You're not getting off with it. I think I've done that one already, but it doesn't hurt to do them again because they only get done once anyway oh right that's interesting to know Katana I'm into the UK easy but it plan to eventually yeah it's uh, uh, one of the things I always say uh, and this is me bragging maybe about the UK and I guess it's the same in every country no matter where you live uh, you always think yours is best um, but the nice thing about UK is if you go down south down to Cornwall and Devon and them sort of places then um, you see some of the um, some nice countryside down there and of course it's got all the um, the ports and the caves and there's uh, mines and heaven knows what else down there so it makes it interesting on a holiday uh, go up to the north of Scotland and see some of the mountains up there and uh, I, I, I don't suppose because you've got the Rockies and uh, them sort of mountains in America so that's a good comparison maybe but certainly you get into Glencoe Pass and uh, around Ben Nevis and them sort of places and the scenery up there is absolutely second to none um, so there you go that's my selling the UK to people it's as good as you're going to get as well I'm afraid oh there's a fire oh come on you s extinguish yourself yeah. oh dear your hygiene's going downhill quick I'll tell you what I haven't got as well now I mention it 
I haven't got one of those. Um, I haven't got one of those fire alarms either, have I? Not that it matters, because the fire engines don't come. I'm told. Yeah, I know. I can see you've got little burns. How much? Well, that was handy, wasn't it? Anybody else would have gone and set fire to the place? Five hundred and fifty-eight as an insurance payment for the items that were damaged in the recent fire. We accept it gladly. But I suppose now we've got to replace it, which is not a problem. Because we've got some money in the bank. Now in the old, oh is that, that's gunked up as well isn't it? Yeah. I was going to say in the old Sims 2, which is the last version I played, um, all the squares around would have been devastated, destroyed, damaged, burned. She's very tense. I wonder why? Why is she tense? Didn't you have a fire every day? Come on. Come on then, Carol. What are you doing? You're going to empty your bladder first. Off you go. Put the phone away. That garden's starting to look quite nice. Oh, somebody was in the shower. Oops, dear, oh dear. I forgot I put her in the shower. Hmm. Yep. Oh, you've, you've played before, Katana. I can see that. Yeah. I'll send her to the shower here. Yeah. So uh, I had that happen when I was having my little trial run as well. Somebody caught themselves on fire, and I I just let them carry on with it. You know, I didn't know what to do, and somebody told me that uh, you had to extinguish it yourself. And for best results, is extinguish yourself. So it's called learning, isn't it? You know, I haven't lost anyone yet, although I have heard that the ghost side of this game is. Um, it is quite interesting. That I dare say that will happen in the future, but I won't. Um, I won't hurry with it. Hygiene, energy. She drops off in the chair, doesn't she? Gotta watch her. Collect new metal. We can sort that for you. Vent to someone. I get like that. But apart from that, everything in the garden is rosy, as they say. Uh, I am creating a new household now. Wow, wow. Yeah. How do you find making a new sim? I mean, do you end up with all your sims looking similar? Or... Do you have a good scope, a good variety of them? That's I know when I've I've gone into the Sim Creator, um, they all come out they're very similar. You look at these three girls, and they are the similar figure, similar build, similar hairstyle. Uh, colours may vary a little bit, but um, all very similar. Uh, get them all to look like the misses, actually. They all do, they all look like the missus. Right, we're not gonna we're not gonna achieve the first target, at least at the moment, which is to reach five thousand simoleons by five o'clock. Um Hunger and hygiene, right. She's taking care of her hunger. What's uh, Libby, Kibby doing? Kibby's just hungry. And Josie's fast asleep. 
and get them out into that garden and see if they can do some uh, harvesting for two minutes and see if that no it's not going to bring in 5,000 well 4,000 simoleons that's for sure Now if I got an expensive shower, would that mean they stay cleaner longer? Right, that's interesting. Make uh, subtle little differences. Yeah, I suppose it's uh, hitting the random button occasion occasionally wouldn't go amiss maybe do that um, but as I say I haven't, I've only made uh, six six characters um, in the game so far so uh, right then harvest it all go on go mad put away your pangs of hunger harvest take a bath and when you've done that you come and harvest oh, when you've done that oh well she'll be stomping and raging around because she's been called out of a bath there we are it's five o'clock failed miserably on my uh, my challenge but hey we can make it up another day I've probably got I've probably got about two or three minutes injury time where I couldn't actually uh, do anything because the sound was wrong and the lighting was wrong. That's my excuse. I'm going to stand by it. How much are we getting for mushrooms? Two each. Two hundred and sixty-two simoleons. That's pretty good for just one harvest, isn't it? Oh, four hundred and eighty simoleons. That's better than a day's wage, isn't it? So it's starting to happen. Although I thought it would happen quicker. Another 400 simoleons there for uh, the bluebells, which are always good. And finally, Esther. No, a potato. That's six. No, nine. There we go. But there we go. That's our garden. As I say, I failed. Oh, I don't know. Not miserably. I've, I've got 50% of the way there. Um, we have made 2,000. Uh, plus, we've had new cookers and new sideboards, uh, repaired fridges, and one or two other things and bits and pieces so although may have failed a bit in the overall mission um, the mission is very good um, can I take the time now to thank all the people that's been here and listening to me this afternoon um, it's my first attempt at twitching uh, and I'd appreciate a bit of feedback say whether I've done okay done bad don't care what it is if it's um, satisfactory that's the achievement of the day um, I'm going to go now. My voice is starting to get um, gruff. It's not being used quite as much. Or I say I don't normally use it quite as much as I have been doing today. Um, so that's the end, I think, of our uh, transmission for today. I'm going to try and be back, possibly on uh, 
Wednesday afternoon. Um, I will put a notice up on the channel to say when the next, and we'll carry on to see if uh, we can get the girls, uh, Josie, Kibby, and Carol, get them to become very rich on Sims. So, thank you very much again for uh, for joining me this afternoon, and I hope your afternoon hasn't been wasted. I've enjoyed it thoroughly. Bye for now. I guess I have to learn how to um, turn on.